Today's rally here at Cleveland State University drew a raucous crowd of about 8,000. It's all part of an effort by the White House to get a last minute surge from young and minority voters. I need you to keep on fighting. I need you to keep on believing. I need you to knock on some doors. I need you to talk to your neighbors. The question now is whether the president's true believers will really turn out at the polls when his name is not on the ballot. Russ? Chip, of course, a lot of places the president could have gone this Sunday before Election Day. Why did he choose Ohio? Well, Russ, you know, most of his recent campaign events have been about holding on to the Senate. This one was about keeping a governor in office, Ohio Governor Ted Strickland. Why is that so important? Because two years from now, when President Obama is up for re-election, it would be a huge advantage to have a Democrat in the governor's mansion in this vital battleground state. I understand that later in the week, the president is going to get out of town in a, in a big way. Is that true? <laughs> He sure is. He's going to Asia for 10 days. So if there are any recounts going on, he'll be following the news from overseas. Russ? Okay. Chip Reed with the president in Cleveland. Thanks a lot.